Today we are at a place called Abacus. It is in Gohati and as you can see it's a microbrewery and kitchen. Now Abacus wasn't Abacus six months back. It was just a, you can say a fine dining place called Legacy for family dining kind of a place. But now if you can see Rabacus as a microbrewery, it has a very nice ambience. When I take you inside, I'll show you. Now we are standing inside Abacus. It's a beautiful looking microbrewery with a fine dining ambience. Now when it was legacy, the interiors were very different. The light, the vibe, everything was very different. But now you can see, as you see, that's a beautiful looking bar there. There's a beautiful lighting on top of, which is like in, uh, you know, in sync with the name. Now the transformation from uh, legacy to abacus wasn't that easy. It was quite challenging because the clientele was already set and it was a very different kind of clientele. And when we thought that we'll get microbrewery here and the menu will change and it will have a different vibe, we were in second thoughts that we will lose some customers in the, in the, in the bargain. But later on we decided to go ahead with the concept and we blended the concept in such a way that now we are getting even better clientele and you know people who are spenders who are who wants to enjoy with their family and friends in a fine dining environment with the vibe of a microbrewery so there were many brainstorming sessions before actually we finalized the name abacus and once it was finalized the interior was decided the food was food menu was decided the bar menu was decided the staff uniform was decided and everything came into place it took some time and uh, to get into a new vibe altogether with a new environment, new kind of attitude required for staff, new kind of training required for staff to get into this vibe of a microbrewery environment. So the greatest insight about this uh, place, the case study will tell you is like when you are transforming a existing restaurant to something else, which is totally different from the existing one, a lot of thought and a lot of alignment is required. and. Uh, that's how you get everything right and everything blends so well. So it is a risky thing, but still if it's done very professionally, it, is, it can be done and we have proven it here. In the last six months, our sales have gone up at least twice as we were doing at Legacy and that's our success. The music has changed, people are liking it very much. A lot of people from all over Guwahati, I can see a lot of new faces whenever I come here. Now we have a very beautiful balcony also here. Previously in the other restaurant before it was there was no balcony, the restaurant was all covered. Now it has been pushed back and a nice open space has been created, which people are liking again. I always tell my clients that anything is possible and anything can be successful. Only things if things are aligned and every con the concept falls into one place and everyone in the team, in the management, in the staff, everybody gets aligned to the concept. That's the most important part of the success for any concert. Right now I'm sitting at the Abacus bar and in this bar a lot of nice modern cocktails are crafted by this barman here and today also I'm going to try something new. Let me also introduce you to the beers of Abacus. So the German beer here, this is a German wheat beer and it is called Achung Baby. And then we have the Belgian wheat beer which is called Tomorrowland. And we have a lager beer, it's a lemon lager brew which is called Saint Lager. And then we have Ciderella which is a rosemary cider. All the beers are really beautiful, I've tasted all of them and I love it. This project has given me the uh, idea that uh, a transformation can happen very seamless, seamlessly if the owners of the place are aligned with you and they also believe in your concept and they also believe in you. So let me introduce you to Varun who is an integral partner of this project and uh, he has been uh, very cooperative and uh, right from the start we have done all the brainstorming together and we are putting everything together and the menu, the staff, what kind of hiring, what kind of menu, what kind of pricing. So we have been working together for a long time in this entire transformation from Legacy to Abacus. I would like to ask Varun, how does he feel about this entire transformation? Yeah, hi. So, yeah, as you also know, it was been a great uh, challenge for us to transform a fine dining restaurant to a microbrewery in a city like Guwahati, 
but uh, yeah i think uh, it was a team effort which has brought us laurels sure. already and uh, the transformation from starting to the designs to the application of the menu to designing of the menu and everything has been a challenge for us but yes we have done it together as a team and now we already can see the results we almost doubled our revenue in in about 6 months time and up uh, the launch of brewery i think will there's a much more longer way to go for us now yeah. and looking forward to it there was a great guidance from mr arun and his team where uh, uh, the menu planning was uh, right on spot uh, we could actually understand the taste palette of the people around in guwahati and design it accordingly and now we can see it working really well for us thank you thank you, thank you so much So that's Rekada. That Rekada is one of the oldest bartenders in Guwahati, and he's been crafting great cocktails in Abacus and all the other restaurants in this hotel. Thanks to Rekada. Cheers. Cheers. Wow, it's really great. So as you can see, there's a lot of hard work that goes into making a place successful, and uh, this place, I'm very happy that it is now rocking. and there are very happy customers all around i can see it and it's a beautiful drink by dekada so with that i'm signing off from guwahati and i'll see you somewhere else in some other restaurant with some new insight and some new challenges and i'll talk about that when i'll be there see you bye